Are you looking for a solution to remove the APT key in Linux? Then join me in this tutorial to learn three easy methods about how to remove the APT key from a Linux system. APT key is basically a part of the APT package manager that manages the APT key and ensures package authentication. However, if you feel like deleting some unnecessary keys, you can do it easily by some easy steps. Usually Debian-based distros like Ubuntu, Linux Mint, Kali Linux, etc. uses this APT key to remove, add or manage keys of the packages. You can also use the GUI to remove the APT key. In the first method, I will demonstrate removing the APT key for two cases. First, let's see how to remove the APT key using the fingerprint. Fingerprint refers to the 10 block hex string of the key file, which varies from key to key. So you can use it to specify the key you want to remove. Now open the Ubuntu terminal and enter the command sudo apt key list. Hit enter and all the keys along with their fingerprints are displayed. Now select the key fingerprint you want to remove. Do right click and copy and now enter the command sudo apt key del double quotation right click and paste to enter the key and closing the double quotation and hit enter and you can see the apt key is deprecated. Now to update the packages write the command sudo apt update hit enter and all the packages along with the keys have been updated. Now moving on to the second case. Let's use the key ID to remove the APT key. It is the key identification number which is the last 8 characters of the key fingerprint. Hence, it is simpler and more user friendly than using the long 10 block fingerprint. For that, write in your terminal sudo apt key list. Hit enter and you can again see the list of the keys along with their fingerprints. Afterward, select the key ID which is the last 8 characters of the key fingerprint. Do right click and select copy. Now enter the command sudo apt key del and the key ID. Again right click and paste. So now hit enter and the key is removed. Now again update your system with the command sudo apt update hit enter. So my system is updated. Now you can again check the key list to verify the selected key has been removed or not. For that run sudo apt key list hit enter scroll up and see that key I selected has been removed. The apt keys are stored in the keyring file. You can find the keyring file in the slash etc slash apt slash trusted.gpg.d location in Ubuntu. After finding the file, you can manually remove the file to remove the apt key. So, to find the keyring file, type in your terminal ls slash etc slash apt slash trusted dot gpg dot d slash hit enter and the list of the key files is displayed now select the key file you want to remove do right click and copy now in your terminal type sudo rm slash etc slash apt slash trusted dot gpg dot d slash the keyring file name and hit enter and the key file is removed. Now before verifying, update your system with sudo apt update hit enter. My system is updated. Now again run the previous command to check the keyring file list. Hit enter and you can see that the key file is successfully deleted from the Linux system. Don't worry if you find it difficult to run code in the terminal. 
you can also use graphical user interface approach to complete the removal procedure with just some clicks. For that, click on the Show Applications icon and then Software and Updates. Now, go to the Authentication tab and here you can see the list of keys. Select the key you want to remove, then click on Remove. Authenticate yourself by providing your password. Now click on Authenticate and the key you selected is removed. Now click on Close and it's done. So finally, you are done with the removal procedure. That's all. I hope you found these three approaches very easy. And don't forget to update your system after deleting any key. So, keep practicing and if you face any problem, check out the comments and the article in the description below for more insights.